Hello everyone, this is Viren and welcome to the fantasy match preview for the game between Delhi and Hyderabad. Now keep in mind that your fan to play leaderboard, the third phase is ending on this weekend. So remember to make 25 teams, especially if you're at that top. Ensure that you seize the advantage, seize the opportunity and get that chance to go all the way to Australia and watch the T20 World Cup finals and if not yet win lots of cash prizes. And yes, on this weekend, the new leaderboard will also be announced. So go make 25 teams now. So first up, the keepers and the batters. I'm going with one keeper in this game in the form of Nicholas Puran. You have another good option in Rishabh Pant, but for now, I'm avoiding him. Apart from that, I'm going with four batters, Kane Williamson, David Warner, and the other two, Rahul Tripathi, who's been the chase master and again, very aggressive, just like the other man, Prithvi Shaw, who's my fourth pick for the game. Now, I see that Tripathi and Shaw both are great GL captaincy or vice captaincy choices. But as far as small league is concerned, my captain for this game is going to be David Warner. Vice captain is going to be Kane Williamson, simply because they both generally start the innings by anchoring it, then go on to pace up the innings. And on the same end, they also are in catching positions for most of those fielding uh, opportunities that they have. So that makes them good captaincy and vice captaincy choices, especially because of that fantasy value in terms of them being able to stick around for longer periods. And now we have the all-rounders and bowlers for this game. I'm going with just one all-rounder for now in the form of Akshar Patel. Sundar's availability is obviously quite uncertain. And similar is the case with few of the other all-rounders in this section. Aiden Makram is a decent choice. Apart from that, I'm going with five bowlers. Natarajan and Bhuvneshwar from Sunrisers. Both of them really good bowlers, have been hitting their lengths well. Apart from that, Bhuvi has been really economical. Is going to get that bag of wickets really soon. And my other three bowlers from Delhi are going to be Shardul Thakur, who's finally got into the wickets after that dry patch. Mustafa Izzur, who's been up and down in every game, but if he's bowling first, 100% remains in my team. And similarly, Kuldeep Yadav, if he bowls second, might be a great GL captaincy or vice captaincy choice. Now let's get to the matchups. So finally, this is what the team looks like with one keeper, four batsmen, one all-rounder and five bowlers. Now let's see what we have in store in terms of your GL drops for the game. So some really interesting matchups in this section. The first one is the aggressive, the man who can hit all those boundaries. Prithvi Shaw has been dismissed twice by Bhuvneshwar Kumar and surprisingly that strike rate is only at 100 which means that Bhuvi does have that upper hand over him. Apart from that, the other matchup is for Kane Williamson who has been dismissed twice by Kuldeep Yadav as well as Shardul Thakur. Decent strike rates in this scenario but maybe Prithvi Shaw is your GL drop for this game especially in the case where he's batting first. And finally, we have the challenge picks. I'm keeping it easy for this game. As you know, my throat is currently not taking it easy. So I'm going with two easy picks for this game in the form of David Warner and Kane Williamson. I think you have a good third pick in the form of whichever bowler is going to bowl first in the depth. So that would either be Natarajan or Mustafizur or Shartul Thakur. So maybe you have a third risky pick if you want to take it. So go make your team now. And apart from that, join us on Telegram for the final team, second innings updates and lots more. All the good luck to you.